Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here one trailer at a time. Today, we're going to have a look at a 2024 E-Pro 15 FBS. Did a quick Google search on this one. I think this is the world premiere. I've never seen one before. Brand new floor plan for 2024. Great travel access. Super nimble unit with a front Murphy bed corner washroom great kitchen on this guy and a side slide weighing 3500 pounds this thing's cozier than a husky in a hot tub and i'm here with my friend that dutch bad boy brendan hannemeyer on the camera today say hello brendan What's going on, happy campers, future campers, and fellow salespeople? Thank you so much for tuning in to the number one RV YouTube channel in the world, giving you the world premiere of this beautiful E-Pro. And we're fired up about it. If you don't mind hitting that like and subscribe button, that'd be awesome. We're also on Instagram, TikTok, and we're on Facebook. We're doing shorter videos there, but they're still phenomenal, so you should check those out as well. The windows on this little guy and the counter space in a real bathroom, I absolutely love it. Yeah, there's so much going for this little guy, man. It, it's it's impressive. It's a really impressive. It's going to be our longest 15 minute, vid 15 foot video out there, I think. Front power jack. We also got the optional bike rack on here. Set of 20 pound per paint tanks, battery in a box location there. We got a great look in front windshield, right? So when the Murphy bed's down, you're going to have some great natural light coming into the unit. Nice unobrow you know, brow light in through here. How about the weather today, Brennan? Beauty day. Just about perfect. A uh, couple of smaller cupboards in through here from the outside. Uh, on either side of our Murphy, we've got our pass-through storage here below our Murphy bed couch. Freshwater fill here, and then we have the rock-solid jacks. I saw those first in the Jacob product that bring them in here to the E-Pro. They're very, very, very solid, which I like on a single-axle trailer. New for 2024, we've got slam-latch doors here on our baggage, which I'm a fan of. Right here is our side slide. It's a narrower trailer, but they still have the tires kind of on the outside, giving you a really nice secure stance. Sewer drain is down through here. Six gallon gas electric water heater, 30 amp detachable style cord, roof ladder. Get up on your roof, check your seals every 90 days. It's a one piece roof, which is just how I like my grandmother's bathing suits. Here, we have an outside shower, and then we have all our plumbing related things done here at the back too. So black water flush kit, winterizing, city water connection, cable satellite inlet, and then a really nice roof ladder like I mentioned. Furnace vent down there, class three receiver to carry like a little tote here in the back side. And then here down the door side, uh, we have our electric awning, spans the entire roof line, couldn't be any longer. We got an outside speaker out here. There's an outside griddle that's gonna clip on here, hook up down below to our gas. There's also an outside table and an outside receptacle. Uh, great looking tires, eh? Yes, very mean. I don't think like the, 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 the big treads has like a functional benefit, but man, they, they look mean. We have the aluminum rims in through here too. TPMS on all these E-Pros as well. Secure step all the way to the ground. Lend a hand grab handle. Double Asdell on these guys as well. Asdell is nice because it doesn't give you a little bit of an off gas that we get on the new trailers. We got the other side of our small cubby and then the other side of our pass through right through here. Anything else you want to touch on on the outside, Brennan? Um, just you got a full size like spare tire as well. Like that's just as meaty. Like underneath the unit as well. Oh, okay. That's really nice. Yeah, great point, Brennan. Um, heading inside, we've got the slide out closed. We can sit down, have some lunch here on our couch. We can watch TV even with the slide out closed. We can come down here, get to our fridge without opening anything up, get to our cooktop, get to our sink, and get to our washroom all without sliding anything open, which is very, very difficult on a smaller unit with a slide. Let's get this thing opened up. Right on folks, we're inside that E-Pro 15 FBS and just such a compact unit with so much in it. It's really, like I'm really kind of surprised, Brendan. Like this is a great little unit. I don't know what we're missing here for a 15 foot trailer. This is awesome. So we do have the reclining seats in through here. I guess they're like the little kick plates. We have this kind of rotating table, which is really convenient. You know, you're really only using this if you're eating inside. Ideally, you're eating outside, right? Um, we have, what else we got here, Brendan? Let's, let's maybe get this off here and out of the way. Yep. Okay, because we're going to want to bring this down to a Murphy bed. Let's just put that out of the way here for a second. Um, we have covered space on either side of our Murphy bed, 
with the hanging bar in through there. There's also our inverter switch, new for 2024. It's a slightly larger inverter, it's 1800 watts. We can flip this up and down. You have to unlock these latches, and then the Murphy bed just comes down nice and easy, like so. Locks into place. You got that front windshield. Is it too bright, Brennan? No, it's really beautiful. Good. Yeah? I love the bedside tables. We've got a receptacle further back in through there, a USB on the left-hand side, another receptacle over here on this hand side. Um, big windows here on either side of the bed too, or a big window on the left-hand side, skinnier one here on the right-hand side. And pretty easy to do that. You know what I mean? Like it is uh, like pulley assistance. So you're not really lifting it up hard. And then there's just locks into place. There we go. Off and in. And then I'll just set this on the couch for now. Slick. Now when I'm sitting here on the couch, I've got a great view here of the TV. It's right across from me. It's a 12 volt TV. I've got a hutch here with a receptacle. Our controls for everything are down here. There is an app you can get on there on your phone for that. A couple nice drawers in through here. And right there's your breakers and your fuses. And then flipping around to the back side of the unit. Talk to me about this kitchen, Brent. I know, amazing kitchen for this size. Like amazing kitchen. We got overhead storage here. We've got windows on both sides. We have a stainless steel sink with a drying rack right above it. Cupboard here. Cupboard there, cupboard here, convection microwave, three burner stove top, rain hood, and the other window I was telling you about. And then to get this fridge, that's great. It's a great looking fridge too, eh? Magic shit. Pantry space here. Now we do have you know a good amount of storage, so I don't know, are you using this for pantry or are you using this for clothes? It would depend, maybe half and half. Yeah. I'd take out one. Yeah, that's a you know nice magnets, nice grab handles. Coming around the corner now, we've got a pocket style door here separating the bathroom off from the living space. Porcelain toilet, the dump truck definitely fits. Good counter space, shelf there, stainless steel sink. Little bit of a uh, shelf in through there or storage in there. Medicine cabinet here, shelf above me. Then we got the standard max fan in the bathroom. Then I'm six feet tall. Let's see if I fit in this shower. Brandon, I do. Yeah, you know I mean, like I can definitely shower in through here. We got a spot for soaps. We got some shelves in here, shower curtain. Just a great little unit, brother. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit us up on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Leave us a comment down below. Have yourself a good day.